In 1999, in the case Stephen Neary, U.S. Navy sailor versus Sheriff Hennessy and District Attorney Hallinan, Larry's legal representative brought these homosexual videos that targeted young military recruits. These were brought to the attention of the Ninth Circuit District and Appellate Courts in San Francisco. They were ignored, they were censored in the press. Illustrated here are excerpts from the Bay Reporter, a male prostitution newspaper that specializes in targeting young military recruits. This is the notorious controversial Wayne Friday, a homosexual activist who was also an employee of the district attorney and a so-called investigator. He was involved with an international sexual predator who was tried in the Ninth Circuit District Court and by the Mexican authorities. Friday likes to brag about his contacts and his believed, suspected influence. Here is 850 Bryant, where Wayne Friday was employed by the district attorney. It's also the city prison for the city and county of San Francisco. With, here is the Ninth Circuit Appellate Court in San Francisco, the headquarters, where these violations of Stephen Neary were brought to their attention in case C9916745. These cases were censored and suppressed by the local media, both legal and corporate, as well as alternative media. But they're certified records and they stand. The Ninth Circuit Court of Appeal did not uphold the illegal conviction of Stephen Neary by the San Francisco Court. Here are certified excerpts, the face page of these filings by Stephen Neary, who couldn't afford a lawyer and had to do it on his own. We did the legal research and investigation and was his legal liaison to the U.S. Navy at their request. And here is part of the certified documentation of how to seduce young military recruits and its connection to the district attorney of San Francisco and his appointees uh, at will, Wayne Friday and Ron Huberman, another sexual homosexual activist. And here is the basement of 850 Bryant where Stephen Neary was illegally brought in March of 1996 and where he spent three and a half years without access to outside exercise or sunlight and no medical care. Guys, first one leader. Here oh, is damn. a preview of how to seduce young military recruits. We will continue with the unexpurgated version of it. Um, we're not going to show the sexual acts. Uh, those are reserved for federal investigators who want to investigate this case and deal with the sex international sexual purveyors of homosexual prostitution and targeting young military recruits as well as young males. They particularly like Marines and sailors. That's just why the military doesn't like these people, and for good reason.